All right, welcome back to the U4. All right, where's my army at? Oh, yes, they're in northern Germany because uh, reasons. Reasons of reasons. Oh, another one of Spain's colonies is rebelling, and even Canada rebelled. Holy shit. King Charles III McCarthy? Uh, what, what is your culture? It sounds English. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. So are colonies more likely to break away in this update or something? Because that's two colonies that have broken away. And... I pretty much never saw colonies break away in their old updates, so... That's interesting. Maybe it's just because England has been struggling a little bit because yeah they're struggling with uh spain right now and also they've probably been struggling with france they haven't taken scotland spain has been struggling with me and portugal so that would explain why their colonies are losing traction and that would also explain why portugal just seems to be chilling uh actually let's look at portugal that'd be easier yeah, let's see 43 32 19 34 20 uh 12 and they're also allied to the ottomans and canada <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I love how Canada is just chilling. And they're American as well. That's that's good shit. <laughs> oh wait, Canada was colonized by Scotland. Yeah, that makes sense actually, yes. That's weird. <laughs> oh, that's really weird. I don't like that. <laughs> Although I like Canada though. Now we just need Florida to form America, but they probably can't do that because they have Mexican culture, so. Oh well. Uh, let's see here. Alright. Back to conquering Africa then. So where's my African army? There it is. Well, I was planning to attack Spain for their Africa colonies, but... Doesn't make much sense now. Also, how many cores does Morocco even have? Yeah. They got a lot. <laughs> hmm, actually... Can I fight the Ottomans yet? I can. Good shit. I like to call France into the war, though, but France is busy fighting a bunch of people. Ah, oh, they're helping, uh, they're helping Spain, I see. That's fine. I don't really want to go to war with anybody right now, then. Actually, no, I, I see somebody I can attack. I can attack Funge. Yeah, Funge it is. Yeah, I gotta get to the Horn of Africa anyways. And if I'm gonna do that... Might as well go this way. Also, I might as well kill the Mamluks at this rate as well. Uh, yeah, when my army gets down into... Where's my ships? There they are. Yeah, when my army gets down to Rome, I'll send them down to Egypt, and then they can take over the, uh, all of Egypt. And yeah, there's also Yemen, Funj. I can ignore Western Africa for a little while. It's not a big deal. Oh, I have more points that need to be allocated. All right. Look at Napoli, I guess. Hmm. There we go. Ten years ahead of time, 25 for admin tech. Oh, bad. Hmm. Yeah, let's get people that I can actually upgrade. Upgrade and who are actually useful. You're useful. And... Hmm, I guess you're useful. There we go. And let's also turn off the admin focus, because I don't really have a monarch point focus anymore, just because I have so many fucking monarch points all the damn time. Alright, Funj, you have no allies. They're even running away at the side of my army, because they're cowards. <laughs> I'm surprised there's a fucking uh, market town here. I mean, I guess it's the only path for trade for Katsina to come this way, but that's, that's weird. <laughs> This shitty nine development desert province. Oh no, it's not a desert, it's a highland. Oh. My oh my, how like <laughs> what? Rebels. What? Oh fu fuck's sake. That's one province. <laughs> Go, get out of here with that bullshit. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Is there anything else I should know about? <laughs> Where are the fucking nazzles gonna be being dicks? Alright, let's attack these guys. There's no time for vassalization. I just want to take them. And uh, yeah, imperialism is better. I've already figured this out. 
Yeah, they're probably gonna try to run through um, their neighbor. Oh, they actually can't run through their neighbor. You hear that? Or they're um, just too stupid to run through them. Alright, uh, you guys head on the boats. And what is that the combat with? Yes, it is good. Good shit. Head on the boats and head to Egypt. Keep converting shit. We have no time for heathens. Alright, split the army because there's fuck all supply in Egypt. Yeah, if the Ottomans want to uh, reclaim their former glory, they have to go through me. And Poland, actually, but nah. <laughs> Alright, let's check the mom looks. Did you seriously have to fail? Useless. Oh yes, and also you need to go down here and take that. Huh, this dude's trying to be all sneaky and shit. Yeah, he's not gonna do shit. Good. More stuff. Alright, let's annex this fool. Let's start coring that shit. Yeah, there's no time for heathens. Just remove them. I don't know where you're trying to run to, mate. You ain't going anywhere. The knights are even here. They're gonna fuck you up. Where are you going? You're going down into, uh, who's this, Yemen? Yeah, Yemen's pretty big. I'm impressed. For a heathen. Hmm. Yep, kill their army. Good shit. Return to Egypt. And let's bring Egypt under control. You know what? I haven't taken the Holy Land yet. I think it's time that I fix that. <laughs> even uh, even the random events agree that I should be the controller of the Holy Land. Oh, Zell. Oh, you bastards. Whatever, those are just noble rebels. They're just gonna be a pain in the ass a little bit. Alright. Remove the heathens from the map. Good shits. Ah, yes. Very good shit. Alright, keep converting the heathens if at all possible, which is not, unfortunately. Alright, we don't need this fort here. Uh, I would like to have some forts down here somewhere, but then again, I'm going to own all of Africa by the end of the campaign, so... Hmm. In fact, what's my money looking like? 634. Not bad. Well, I am kind of running out of places to build, uh, to build shit in, and Africa is not a very good place to build stuff in, because how fucking poor it is. Hey, France, you done those wars yet? Nope. All right, I'll come back to you later. Can I attack Morocco? Mm, no. Can I can attack Yemen. So what is the Horn of Africa region? All of this. Well, that's easy. I can easily get that just from attacking Yemen. Own six provinces in the Horn of Africa. And then I get trade... Whoops. I get trade efficiency and global trade power. I just need to do the, the Prester John mission. And then I can end the schism. Huh. Yes, yeah, so that would be tricky, but definitely possible. And yeah, it just has to be whoever controls Moscow is Catholic, right? Yes. I suppose I could give the Livonian Order some more land. Snake our way to Moscow. <laughs> uh, end the schism. And uh, yeah, call it a day. Let's see, we also have... I also have to invade Mashrik. That shouldn't be too difficult. And I can also... At least four, currently three problems in North China or South China are owned by a Catholic. That shouldn't be too bad. Wait, what? What do you mean it's owned by a Catholic? I see no ca- Oh! Because Spain conquered Taiwan, I see. Or, well, not conquered, they colonized it. 
All right, that should be pretty simple, especially because I could probably just buy a province from China. In fact, can I buy a specific province? I want Nanjing. Or wait, no, not Nanjing. Nanjing's like up there somewhere. Although I think Nanjing would work. Uh, which, which provinces are it? Fuck, I can't remember. Oh my. China, you're not looking too hot over that, friend. And I'm attempting to make the situation work. I believe it's Canton. I believe it's Canton that, uh, is the thing. I would like a charter company. Ah, I can't reach them. Shit. Huh. Okay, I mean, I could probably, like, do some hopping. I could probably reach... I could probably reach Zanzibar down here, right? Let's buy, um... Actually, no, let's buy Vatomandri or Mitembi. Charter company, this one right here. Boom. <laughs> here I come. I'm island hopping, bitches. With my extremely thick wallet. Hey, Ming. What if I were to buy Canton from you? I could very easily sweeten the pots. Oh, my. Ming, Ming, Ming. <sighs> Why must you make things so difficult? Fine. If you wish, I will come over there and kill you if I have to, but... Hmm. Alright, start covering the heathens in the land that I just purchased. Oh, I found an Indian trading company. Good shit. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, indeed. Alright, let's go ahead and get some trade from Ethiopia. Good shit. I suppose it's time to fight Yemen. Uh, these heathens shouldn't be too big of a deal. Actually, let's prepare the main army. I just got a shit ton of mercenary companies, all because I just got a, like, some weird-ass provinces. That's good shit. Timmy is still around. Oh. Is you around? No, I think they're dead, sadly. No, well. Is the Northern Army in position? Yes, they are. Good. Let's put an end to these heathens, shall we? Delhi, Ajran, Mushara. These heathens not scare me. Their heathen delusions do not matter either. Actually, if you control Mecca, doesn't that give somebody who isn't a uh, Muslim a bonus? I have to find Mecca. There it is. Yes, being a good Christian and conquering Mecca gives you a bonus. Well, well, well. Silly heathens. What if I were to just burn your holy city? Sounds good to me. Let's see. Okay, they have a fort down there. I'll send the Africa army down there. Oh, these guys are even having rebel problems. Pfft. Pathetic. I have to be at peace these land. Damn it. Oh, wow. The nobles have no land. In fact, I pretty much control the entire nation. <laughs> That is some good shits. As it should be. <laughs> Clear my overextension? I'm already doing that, man. That's a good fucking mission. I love that mission. Hmm. Unfortunate. Let's keep raising my mercantilism. Because that'll keep the burgers happy, even though they're going to have fuck all influence because they have no power. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why am I losing? Excuse me. It's because I haven't taken their capital yet. I mean, I feel like I'm doing good shit. My great army is just marching through the land. <laughs> ah, look at my enemy sort of squabble around fighting England. What the fuck are you doing here? <laughs> Alright, England's just marching through the Horn of Africa for some reason. 
Probably best if I don't question it, to be honest. Yeah, I have no idea. No. So, I'll have to send somebody back to go deal with that. I guess that'll be you. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and merge my two armies together. Yeah, even though this is the... Damn, that was fast. Alright, never mind. We're going to keep taking this slow then. Yeah, just keep sieging, my friends. We'll beat these heathens eventually. Let's see. Ooh. Good shit. I just keep getting free development. Excellent. Hmm. Does the man we have the next tech? He's on 22. Oh my, he's a few techs behind. <laughs> and I could spend my monarch points developing Italy then. Good shit. Yeah, that problems will be retaken by the fort. Excellent. There's no time for heathens. Just remove them. There are a lot of heathens in this area. I don't like that very much. Yeah, let's unite my two halves of my main army. Oh boy, bribes are growing more accepted, eh? Ultimately, I'm rich as fuck and I don't care about bribes. <laughs> Alright, unite the main army. Good shit. And time to deal with the enemy armies. Destroy them. Siege of Shawa is over once again. Alright, there goes the Delhi army. And there goes the Azuron army. Oh yeah, Azuron's right here, aren't they? Yes, they are. Interesting. Am I the Papal Controller? Good, as it should be. Let's see here. Uh, we don't have a crusade target. And you know what? I feel like crusading down here where I am. There we go. Heathens! I banish thee! I just gained a fuck ton of cores. Good shit. England's no longer a valid rival. Of course they aren't. They're weak as shit. And I'm thick as fuck. Look at how thick I am. The English wish they could own this much of Africa. Alright, let's see here. Mm, yeah, quarantine the port. I don't want to deal with, like, just losing a fuck ton of money because of a damn event. Actually, you know what? Let's... Re, uh, let's get the armies together again. Hmm, unfortunately, I can't cross the straits. Although the Ottomans and other people are willing to let me through, so yeah, that's good shit. That's fucking good shit, man. Alright, which one of you heathens wants to get purged? Delhi? Alright, you first, bitch. Yeah, that's right. Who's next? Uh, Mushaha? Purged. Come on. Where are the heathens? Let me see them. Oh, they didn't get purged. They only got beaten up. That's fine. Hmm. Trying to find the enemies in this wasteland is annoying. Let's see, who is this? Yemen? Time to be purged, you heathen scum. Let's see. Now their allies are uh, staunchly defending them. Impressive. I suppose they know what will happen if uh, Yemen falls, since Yemen is sort of the last bastion <laughs> in Africa. Yeah, all their African friends are going to get purged. <laughs> all their Indian friends are going to get purged. Oh shit, Prussia's down here. Good shit. Alright, let's go down to uh, Najran then. 
Let's see, are any of your friends willing to falter? Delhi is good. That heathen knows what's best for them. And their people. Ah, let's keep the purging going. As a day of purging is never done unless you purge at least 10,000 individuals. Now get over here, you bastards. Yes, independence for the filthy rebels. The heathen rebels. So annoying. Oh well, we will get rid of them eventually. Oh, and my glorious heathen enemies have decided to fight my rebels for me. What good friends they are. <laughs> oh. What the hell did they get into West Africa? Oh well, it matters not. Azron, get out of my sight. You filthy heathen. Mushara is over here. The Siege of Nazarin is over. Good. And that's that army dead. Excellent. Let's hunt down the rest of these heathens and execute them all. But first, we must go back to Italy and do some development. Because, uh, yeah. I'm not going to leave my shit to be uh, low on development. They must all be high as fuck. See here. Good shit. Good, good shit. Have elected Brabant, eh? Interesting. Such a silly division. Why would you want such a weak emperor? Siege of Benin is over. How annoying. The age of revolutions. Well, well, well. What does this entail? Because I have not been here in a long time. Have a government with a parliament? No. Be an emperor, of course. Have a subject with 250 developments. Excellent. We have a subject with 2,000 developments. What? That's me, you stupid game. That's, that's me with that development game. Why are you so dumb? Whatever. Have 125% discipline. What is mine at? Hmm. Where is this one? Oh, there it is. Huh. Could be better. Actually, if I raise my absolutism, it would be a bit better. It would be up to 20%. Then I just need to get another 5% from somewhere. Let's see. Have 50 dev capital, eh? I could do that. Yeah, I definitely could do that. Have a 3-star general or admiral in command of a unit. And own two institution origins. Which do I own? Renaissance and... Oh, it might be because, yeah, my vassal owns it. Okay. Hmm, well, I need to develop Rome, then. For Rome must become 50 developments. Yeah, wait, shit, that's the wrong edict. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, well. We'll wait a little bit longer, then. These heathens are tricky. Oh, I forgot about these guys over here. You can go away now. Yeah, so I just want to deal with you. Heathens, I just want to talk. Actually, you're willing to fuck off now. Good. There's a salt crisis, eh? No, oh, well. Right, let's take the heathen capital. I don't think I will take Mecca in this war. That just seems... inappropriate. Or I could have it be an exclave, I suppose. Hmm. I would like to have Mecca. Show the heathens that their cause is not worth fighting for. Let's see what I can get. Which would be cheaper to take? That one, definitely. Take these provinces, and then I'll just take the entire coastline of the Horn of Africa. Prevent the heathen from being able to... Stop any rebels that show up here. And let's connect my Africa territories. Good. I'll see what else I want. I'm sure there is more that I want. It's just a matter of finding it. Hmm. Rebels are sieging my territory that I've occupied. 
How annoying. Oh well. Let's split the army again. And yes, continue to siege everything. As there's no time for heathens, and there never will be time for heathens. Never. Alright, can I develop my capital now? No, I need to wait a little while longer, unfortunate. So many heathens in this nation, and they're all rising up. How annoying. I'm going to be honest, I think I'll just take whatever they're willing to give me and leave. Whoops. Oh god, my mouse is fucking up. Hmm. I think I'll take this, yes. They won't be able to stop any rebels that are in the their exclave. I take Mecha. Actually, I'm a bit over my overextension. Fine, I'll let them have a little bit more land. Only a little bit, though. Actually, I kind of want to keep that one, because that one's pretty good, apparently. There we go. They still can't access their exclave. I have access to basically all of Africa. And I get Mecca. Good shit. Goods, good shit. Oh, and as it turns out, I now own provinces in the Horn of Africa. Very, very nice. Trade efficiency, global trade power for 10 years. The Holy League. Florida, France, Bohemia, and Kingdom of God gets... Ooh, they get interesting effects. Interesting. Huh. I need to invade Mashrik. I suppose I was going to do that anyways, because I need to control Jerusalem. The knights also have land that they would like to take. I think the Ottomans are my next target, then. It only makes sense. Portugal will not be willing to help them. That's unfortunate. Is France willing to help me? France! Why do you like heathens? That is unacceptable! <sighs> Get my men ready to fight the heathens. Hmm. Yes, the Africa army will start in the Suez. The main army will start in... Uh, they're gonna start somewhere. Probably in... That's a lot of heathens. Mecca is difficult to convert. I suppose that makes sense, yes? <laughs> oh, well, you heathens can't stop me. I'm far too powerful for you. Now, let's develop Rome. Make it the greatest city in the world. Excellent. More. All, all roads forever lead to Rome. For Rome is the greatest city. I refuse to believe there is a city greater than mighty Rome. I just need to find it. If there is one. Huh. <laughs> Of course, there's no city greater than Rome. The heathens know nothing about managing a city. And the good Catholics and other... And I suppose the heretics. At least the heretics know how to build cities, but the heathens, they know nothing. I've lost trading in coal. Ah, unfortunate. That means that my enemies are beginning to get coal as well. That's fine. I only have one coal area anyways, so it's not ultimately a big deal. Actually, my Africa army needs to stay down here to deal with the heathens that might potentially come north. My main army, on the other hand, will head north and hopefully deal good shit. France! Why? Ah! Fine, I'll help you in your silly war. Kind of busy, though. Oh, I should probably... I should probably core Mecca before converting it. That'd probably be a good idea. Let's core Mecca. Oh, wait, I physically can't even convert it. Or core it, because fuck. Alright. 
Cool. <laughs> I just wasted some of the time that I was converting it. Oh, well. Let's see. Yes, there's one reform left. I would like that reform a lot. A pirate republic has shown. Well then. <laughs> That's the first time I've seen that happen. At least by the AI. Florida, Illinois, and Canada. My oh my. It's very interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. Well, unfortunately, France won't help me in this war anymore. Whatever, the Ottomans are weak. They're dying. Their empire is worthless. I don't need the help of my allies to defeat them. I have my vassals. Let's see, where is it? Imperialism! Let's put an end to these heathen delusions of a great empire. You know, let's do their strategy of blocking the straits. The Kanem Famine. Interesting. Yes, let's also suppress all the rebels. Good. And you know what? Because it's an exclave, I think I'll allow the people of Mecca to govern themselves, I suppose. Mostly in hopes they fuck off and don't cause me any problems. <laughs> 45 day siege ticks. Oh my. And it's a coastal fort. And. Oh, it's not a level 8 fort actually. Shit. Ah, France. Good. Prepare for war. And trust me more, okay? Now, are you willing to join me in this war against the Ottomans? Really? Damn it, France. Oh, well, I don't need France for this war. It would have been nice if they joined, because they would have made it a lot easier, but I didn't need them. Oh, my. I think Ethiopia is going to come to existence. Hmm. That'll be interesting. I might let Ethiopia live, actually, if they come out the correct religion. If they don't come out the correct religion, though, then I might have to be away with them. Let's see, Prussia is here, the Knights are obviously here. What about Livonia? Hmm. I need to get them access down here, it seems. They aren't being very useful, unfortunately. That's fine. You heathen delusions matter not to me. I have taken Ankara from the heathens. Wait till they are movement locked. Messina. What? Rebels? Over there? What? That's even a Kovetic province. Are you mad? I suppose so. Alright, let's snake our way to Western Africa as well then, I guess. Yeah, there's still a lot of angry heathens over there. Yeah, I don't know why the hell I'm filling it in when I don't need to. Yeah, the army will automatically deal with any heathens, so should be fine. Though there might be some separatist sentiment that gets uh, spread around. Hmm. Ah, these rebels. When will they learn that I am trying to make the world a better place? I suppose never, because they're vile heathens. So these rebels over here. So many damnable rebels. Uh, so the Balkans is being occupied over time. That's a lot of Ottomans right there. Yes. How are they doing so good on that siege? They just are. Interesting. 
Oh, right, because they're doing a, um, their siege isn't coastal while mine is, and a lot of other crap, really. Huh. Oh, well. Wait, how do they do that? Excuse me. Ottomans, what are you doing? Oh, well, I suppose it doesn't matter. If they want to occupy Africa while I occupy the heartland, that matters not to me. They can waste their time all they want. Let's see, how's this all 30 dev? Good shit. Let's take away that. Let's start developing this area. go excellent my general died oh my god why are there so many heathens I'm not even over 100% over extension this is madness I tell you actually am I below I'm not below 100% good Man, I keep losing these damn siege races. Alright, good. Hopefully the rebels will stop being dickheads. That'd be great. Ottomans occupy... Kuss. Siege of Ankara is over again. Come on, Ottomans. Stop running from you, coward. Come face me, you coward. Oh, are they going to Ankara? They're doing something. Uh, let's see, I have more devotion, I believe. Yes, I do. Good shit. Mm, they're going to Ankara? Yes, good. Head to Ankara, my heathen friends. And we can talk about your surrender there. Kill them all. Leave not one standing. Good. Now then, as for the damn rebel scum. Yes, they're causing quite the ruckus in Western Africa, aren't they? Hmm. That's fine. They've also occupied Mecca. How annoying. Oh well, the heathens will know their place soon enough. More rebels? Oh, well, at least they showed up where my army already was. Oh, shite. There we go. Ah, the Ottomans are in Egypt. These rebels are everywhere. It's a pain, really, but it's not too bad, I suppose. Really? Two boats can blockade this province? Oh, I guess only five Roman. I guess that makes sense, yes. I suppose the danger of that fort is if you can't get boats there. And let me tell you, once I build the Suez, nobody is going to be able to blockade that fort. Oh my. So many damn heathens. And they're all rebels as well. Oh, why can't the heathens just learn to lie down and bleed to death? Like, honestly. More heathens dead, all because they didn't learn that they could just shut their mouths and sit down and follow the true faith. But no, they decide to fight back because they're damn fools. More development. Oh my god. Ottomans, you cheeky bastards. That's annoying. I'll have to get the, uh. Get the prosperity back up there. Damn. Yeah, I can't get any, like, good admirals. All my admirals are shit. Trade protection against Poland. Truce with Delhi. Something, something. Yeah, there's three rebel armies and a lot of rebel provinces in West Africa. That's unfortunate. I have a church in Napoli. Really, I don't have one there already. Huh. 
Yeah, sure, I'll build the church there. Napoli. Boom. And then I'll actually give Napoli another point of development, so I'm happy with that. Hmm. Yes, I've already have their capital. I would like Jerusalem, my heathen friends. Although I need a bit more than just Jerusalem. I need 16 provinces in this area. Huh. One, two, three. I forget what this area consists of already. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. There we go. I can give the rest of the land to the knights. They're good boys. They deserve it. Actually, let's deal with Greece next. Yeah, we'll deal with this one Ottoman fort, then we're going to invade Greece. Well, I suppose Cyprus, but whatever. Ooh, my rebels are going to Spanish Guinea. I like that. That's some good shit. Also, what do you guys... Ugh, fine, I'll control you manually if you're going to be a bitch about it. Ah. <sighs> The rebels suppressing army sometimes, man. They just don't want to work. What? Oh, fuck off, Ottoman. Seriously? <sighs> Worthless navies. You can't fucking do anything with them, because it doesn't matter what you do. They're shit. <laughs> they never work. <sighs> Ottomans. Uh-oh. I have to pull my fleet away. Yeah, I do. You know what? I might just say fuck the galleys and just build heavy ships, to be honest. Especially because the galleys have done nothing but disappoint me. Better cannons. Excellent. Hmm. Huh. Yes, this war does seem to be taking a little while. I think I'm going to end this video here. Actually, no. Let's siege incel here first. Or whatever the hell it's called. I, I sell, not incel, whatever. It matters not. All that matters is that these heathens are purged at some point or another. There we go. I sell has been captured. And I will see you next time for the finishing of the Ottomans. I'll see you there.